hectic we have black goku he basically went back to his own timeline so he could get stronger so he will most likely come back with another transformation or he might just come back with the true form being revealed because a lot of people are speculating that that's not actually black goku and on top of that he might even have super saiyan white i know a lot of people have been thinking about that so he will be crazy but there's been one thing that i've been thinking about who will be the person to defeat Black Goku? Because I've been looking, when I've been watching Dragon Ball Super, I realized that they've been giving my boy Goku all the shine ever since it started. He was the one who took out, well, he was the one who was able to fight on Power of Beers. He's the one who took out Frieza. And not to mention the fact that he had the best fight with Hit. And if he takes out Black Goku again, then this will really be GT vibes. And I mean, one of the uh, biggest reasons why I like Dragon Ball Z is because a lot of people are getting love. Gohan was getting love, Vegeta, everybody, they was sharing around, but with Super, it's been Goku, 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 with a little bit of hints of Vegeta here and there, just Goku and Vegeta, so now I think it's a perfect time for both Goku and or not Goku, and now I think it's a perfect time for Gohan and Trunks to get their shine. Now, the reason why I say Gohan is because he said that he wanted to be trained, and we know that Piccolo, he, even though he's, uh, I think that Gohan, if he does end up getting trained by Piccolo, he's going to surpass him easily because... Gohan's power it's basically just dormant it's not like that he got like lost it forever it's just that he stopped training so if Gohan starts training again he's going to get back to that strong level that he was at back in the Cell Saga so sooner or later he's going to end up surpassing him now even when he does end up surpassing him what's next I'm pretty sure that Mystic Gohan won't be able to stand up against him so I don't think that'll do anything and on top of that he will probably even get like even if he did get Super Saiyan 2 that wouldn't be enough to take out Black Goku I'm going to go out here and say, what if him and Trunks do fusion? Now, hear me out. The reason why I say what if they do fusion is because we know that Gohan, we could assume that when he gets stronger, he's going to have to get at least somewhere near Trunks level. Because I do think that Trunks is stronger than him. And what, who, how epic would it be to have the teacher and the student using fusion and actually coming together fighting Black Goku? It will make a lot of sense too because Gohan, he wants to get stronger. Trunks, he wants to get revenge for what black for what black goku did to him so if they actually did fuse it would be amazing and on top of that piccolo's one who taught goten and gohan or goten and trunks the fusion so he could reteach it to them it'll make sense and it'll also be nostalgic towards dragon ball z seeing them learning fusion all over again maybe they'll have some mistakes and they'll end up being fat and all that stuff so Overall, I do think that the people who should take down Black Goku, it should be Gohan and Trunks, whether they're fused or not, simply because on one hand, Trunks, he needs to get his revenge, and I think that this would be a huge point for Gohan if he actually did come out here and actually assist or did take down one of the main villains because we know that Zeno, he's going to have another uh, tournament, with, he's going to have another tournament with all the universes.